It's 914 in the morning, and that's a live look from our Hilton San Diego Bayfront Hotel camera. Good morning to you on this Friday. Well, this is a treat. You know her from the big screen and television, but now you can catch actress Tara Grammy right here in San Diego in the Pulitzer Prize winning production of English. And she's here with us on the morning show. Tara, good morning. So good to see you. Thank you for having me. I am so, I was so happy when I heard that English is coming to San Diego. I have the opportunity to see it on the East Coast. And I've shared this that my husband, who saw it and never, very rarely gets emotional. I looked over and he just was bawling. And the story is something that resonates not only, I would say, with the Iranians, but really anybody who has had to migrate and have to start over in another country. Absolutely, absolutely. To me, I, like you said, English can be mean something different to different people, but to me it's about finding your identity and how we find our identity through language. Okay, you talk about this production for anybody because it's here in San Diego. It's opening this weekend. It'll be here for a month. What is the production? Explain it to us. The, the play? Yeah, the play. So it takes place in Karaj, which is a small city outside of Tehran in Iran. And it's uh, a class with four students in it that are preparing for an English proficiency exam called the TOEFL. Mm -hmm. um, and my character is, uh, she just got into medical school in Australia and she has to get a good score on her TOEFL in order to really be accepted into the university. So there's like high stakes and um, yeah, everything kind of falls apart. It's a really good show. When did you leave Tehran? Were you, were you born there? In I Iran? was born in Tehran, yeah. Okay. I, we left when I was six. And you came here? No, I actually grew up in Toronto. Oh, uh, Toronto yeah, in Canada. Yeah. But learning that English language, and I know there's people watching right now that, you know, it's just not easy. I can't imagine what that would be like to have to start over and speak a language and not be able to communicate and struggle with that. Absolutely, absolutely. I, I'm lucky. I think kids it's much easier for because you mm -hmm. learn so quickly. And my mom was actually an English teacher in Iran. So, yeah, wow. so um, the character, the, the teacher character in the show, Mar Marjan, really resonates with me because my, my mom was like Marjan. Um, but yeah, I can't imagine how hard it would be as an adult to learn another language. Did you, anybody in your family, have uh, the ability to help you when you were learning like the language? Because you were speaking Persian before, right? Before you came and you had to learn English. Yeah, my, my mom was an English teacher, so she only spoke English with me at home. So I actually spoke English when I, I'm lucky. I, I, I had a different experience. But, you know, I grew up I, being Iranian Canadian or Iranian American. We grew up ar around a lot of um, people who are learning the language. So I've seen a lot of it growing and you, up. And I know, Tara, um, this past few years, Iran has been in, in the news a lot. So we have this production, but you use this opportunity to also talk about what's happening, uh, you know, in the homeland. Um, I mean, right now we're talking about um, protesters that are still getting executed today. Yeah. Um, one was executed a few days ago, Mohammad Qobadu, and it's, it's heartbreaking. It's really difficult to, to separate um, our Iranian identity, as I know you know, Shadi Jun, with um, our American one. Yeah, absolutely. I was just looking over my shoulder just a moment ago, and there was a photo of your entire cast. Yes. Can we meet them? <laughs> oh this is your gosh. cast over here. And your set, I mean, this is pretty much it. It's like a classroom when yeah. people come to, to watch it. Yeah. Uh, this, the cast is amazing. We have Mary Opik, who's a legendary Iranian actress. Um, oh, this is a scene from the show where this is actually um, a rehearsal that they taped. Okay. We don't look like this. This is our rehearsal room. Uh, this is where uh, my character and Mary's character are actually having their first conversation in English. So I it's super funny. I remember that Yeah, scene. it's a funny scene. I remember scene. <laughs> that scene. What do you want people to take away with? Because it's really a production for so many, and it's in San Diego for a month. When they leave, what do you want them to take away with them? I hope they have a sense of um, empathy for, for people whose first language isn't English. Um, I, that's something that is very close to my heart, is, is just empathy for, for people who are having a hard time. Um, I think, I hope that they take that away. And immigrants in general. And immigrants. It yeah. really is a story about immigration yes, and absolutely. having to leave so much that you know and you're so confident to have 
and starting uh, somewhere new. So you are here now in San Diego. Yes. Tell us about the show. It's opening this week, right? Yes, it opens this week. It's at the world-renowned, I mean, uh, incredible regional theater, The Old Globe. Yes. And it's a really, really good show, directed by Arya Shahi, who's Iranian, and he's his next show's in, on Broadway. The, our other star, Puya Mohseni, is taking English to Broadway. So it's like an all-star yes, cast. And this yeah. is a pure surprise-winning yes. production. This is Sana's to see won the Pulitzer. Incredible. This is amazing. Okay, yeah. we're going to get the tickets. i got to find a day to come back and watch this Please again. Come see I will. It. I will. I'm going to work on it. We'll get the information up on our website for you, foxeyesandiego.com. Click the scene on tab if you want to get tickets. They're running here through February 25th. Tara, thank you for being here. Thank you, I can give you a high five. June, 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 June. We'll be right back. Oh, Good my gosh. We love you so much. We love you so much.